नमस्ते शार्क्स मैं मला रो में अली आया मैं तागे रीता मैं ताखे तामो हम दोनों अरुणाचल प्रदेश से और एक बहुत ही सुंदर जगह जीरो वैली से हम आए हैं हनी फलों को लेके हमने फार्मर्स को अपलिफ्ट करने के लिए और हमारा कम्युनिटी को बढ़ावा देने के लिए हमने वाइन बनाया आपको ऑफर मिल चुका है इससे मैं बाहर हूँ और एक ऑफर बताऊँ फाइव परसेंट फिफ्टी लाख में और ट्वेंटी फाइव को आप लोन में दे दीजिएगा टेन परसेंट so uh, the shark tank amount that they that we have pitched for actually like it was a very uh, small amount that we asked for actually and our main target was that we want to get deal from the shark and we want to open up the business what we have uh, seen is that like you know we like we you know like people from you know my community and you know if we take into uh, our own you know the whole state also so what we what i see is that like we don't open up on the you know our own business and then uh, we don't understand the concept of equity sharing so this is something which is lacking and then uh, and for us like right from the beginning we didn't want to remain as a you know small family i mean family business type like that and of course we do want to have our own legacy of you know um, our work but then like if we have until and unless we have this uh, corporate inv- investors coming into a uh, picture we would really not be able to you know go you know explore the full capacity and the potential that you know our place has, has to offer to the world and once we uh, you know get a real deal the partnership you know uh, once we start sharing you know we start getting connections the networking becomes stronger and then you also learn and apart from you know just you know getting uh, some sort of deal from them uh what is important is like you know uh, i'm sure you know the sharks are going to mentor us a lot and they're going to teach us a lot for that reason like we went to shark tank and and uh, i would not count on the you know the amount that they've you know uh, promised us through the deal um, on the day of pitching but i would count more on 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 their experience on their sharing and then scaling up our business and also to you know motivate other you know um entrepreneurs of our natural and northeast like you know and we not only can have winery in zero valley but we can have wineries in all the districts of you know many other districts of our natural pradesh like that so that's you know i that's our way of opening the business and letting people know that we have the resources and uh, we have the capability also i did start my journey uh, 2016 17 17 was the time that uh, we launched our brand naraba and uh, we started to work in 2014-15 where we want a uh, went on a practical um search on our own you know how would starting a winery could impact uh, our own place our community zero valley and also you know uh, the entrepreneurial world that we were going to uh, start so uh, in the beginning we never thought that you know we would come up to uh, this Uh, level at this level i mean to say that you know i would never thought i would get invited from a uh, shark tank something a show called shark tank you know which is a very enriching a real life experience that i had because uh, and i want to tell the viewers that it was not actually me who was uh, keen on going to shark tank in the beginning it was a shark tank team that had um, looked for me and i'm very grateful uh, to them uh, after you know uh, going there and the meeting the sharks so for nearly about a year uh, they have been uh, sending me mails email and then calling me like that so in may june 2022 when i was in the us that time also like they were contacting me like you know when are you coming back we you know we want you to uh, you know share your pitching with us and then um, you know come to the platform so uh, and i was not uh, honestly i was not very serious into this uh, as because like morning to evening i used to rush here and there you know being uh, you know uh, handling so many things there when i'm uh, there in zero so but then like uh, the last date went uh, got over and then like um, then even after the last last date uh, you know like we lost the date by you know we were late by one month but still you know they were since they were 
calling me you know constantly so like i submitted the form and then got selected through uh, and um, we went for this uh, in person offline audition also and there to the well, i mean those organizers they were very impressed with our presentation because uh, i must say like i go through it because whatever we do practically we present it to them you know very honestly we presented our work there and uh, they liked our idea so and the work that we were doing and that's why like we got to meet the sharks also we met five sharks on the day and um, it was very nice and when we went like when we uh, were supposed to meet the sharks our one aim was that you know we should get you know at least some deal from the sharks because uh, adura khali hat nahi wapas aana chahta tha so uh, then we prepared ourselves very well uh, before going to meeting the sharks and that's how we we got the deal also and going there i must say like deal is one thing uh, more than that what is uh, you know what i uh, you know feel is that we learn i learned so much you know because in every step of the selection procedure there are highly professional people involved the organizers there so i got to learn so much which you know like uh, like doing business is one thing but then doing it properly with proper records now which is so important so that actually with records figures and numbers uh, actually authenticates your work so i learned this in a very short period of time through shark tank india season 2 and so i'm very grateful to them and i want to ask all the you know budding entrepreneurs uh, aspiring uh, you know youths like who wants to take up uh, entrepreneurship that they should um, you know avail this opportunity opportunities like shark tank because now season 3 is going to start soon we went uh, to the gateway uh, episode so uh, soon season 3 will start so they all should apply for this and if anyone wants to take some tips uh, from us from me now they can contact me i can help them and and if they get through it will re um okay. ma'am i would like to know uh why did you or what prompted you to start or what motivated you to start now or why did you have prior experience in wine making uh not actually in wine making <laughs> but uh, see i started engineering in nevis so uh, there during uh, the course of my study i uh, we there was a chapter on wine making so a theoretical you know theoretically i knew what is wine making what is fermentation and all that that's all but uh, this taking up full pleasure into uh, you know in, in this world of wine making like we had to have our own wine maker a professional wine maker there are different um you know they do certain kind of you know different studies are there so we need to have a very qualified experience wine maker in our winery uh, and i do have that uh, but yes you say like what prompt you or what inspired you to you know take up this is that you know i keep i i, I keep telling even in shark tank also i said like uh, initially i was a bit reluctant on having our own winery because it's going to cost a lot in terms of uh, resources in in terms of you know time management and all that because uh, at that time like i was um, i was a mother with very very young kids so we thought you know as a first generation entrepreneur me and my husband we had to involve our, ourselves so much into that then you know we wouldn't be look able to look after our uh, kids children then we had our own you know our own work apart from that so uh i was a bit reluctant but then uh when he was very very you know insistent on his uh, idea and his vision like i started thinking about it and then i went on a field study and i did some socio economic research on my own what could be the you know impact uh of having a winery in a very small place like zero valley then uh we went to see like what kind of uh, niche um raw material that we're going to use and we saw kiwi fruits at that time rotting on the ground so it was mountains and mountains of kiwi at that time which now has you know is no more i must say like farmers have started exporting their fruits to neighboring states and uh, you know some of the buyers they directly come to the farm gate to the farmers so the mo- the main you know uh, inspiration and the motivation has been you know uh, like 
has been the farmers of Zero Valley, and also like we have, we we like both of us, we are very passionate. You know, me and my husband, we are very passionate and self motivated person. That is one thing, and uh, we also saw an opportunity, a business opportunity of having a winery and then, you know, uh, empowering so many people along with us. <laughs> See, uh, we have uh, our company like uh, Nala Abba, like initially in two thousand. 17 when we launched like we just had 20,000 liters capacity and from there we have ex uh, we have upgraded and expanded it to uh, increase up to 40,000 liters per batch and then now uh, my tank hall is full like and we, we are full capacity like uh, at, at full capacity 60,000 liters per batch so but having said that like you know just putting up a tank hall and then making wine that, that that's not the only aim like what we want is like we want to uh, encourage the concept of wine tourism in zero valley and also you know we want it to be you know like replicated in all other uh, districts of Arunachal Pradesh so now we are in the process of upgrading and expanding our winery to a new location to my to our own orchard uh, where like uh, the capacity would be much higher and then we can uh, have a, we can you know play in volumes in the market and also like you know the concept of wine tourism like you know uh, in the right from the beginning we had we had idea about Napa Valley then we had visited Sula Vinyas like that so and there we saw like how much we can you know um, gain you know from the uh, local resources that are there how much we can empower local youths and you know skill them you know how we can you know build a uh, that ecosystem in a rural area you know without touching this the modernity you know the modern world without you know our people going to uh, shifting to cities and looking for jobs we can you know uh, generate employment in our own place so that was our plan our vision right from the beginning and we are still you know aspiring towards that Uh, I was overjoyed, I must say, and our Honorable Chief Minister, he has been very supportive, like, uh, I have never met him in person, but then um, I think he, I mean, he knows so many things, you know, he keeps in touch, he's very updated, so he knows what's happening all over. And then I think he's, I mean, I feel he's also the youth icon of our state. And when he wrote, uh, when he tweeted and then shared, shared from his social media accounts about uh, Shark Tank India and me being, uh, going there and pitching, like, I felt very nice and, and I felt grateful because uh, that not only uplifts my spirit and motivates, but also there are many youth, so many followers are there, you know, in his, uh, uh, so many followers he has in all his social media accounts. So definitely, I'm sure like many youths will be you know watching that uh, you know get motivated and they'll have that gust to take up something on their own. So, any words of motivation to our viewers? Uh, I keep telling the same thing. What I say is like. Um, Anybody can chase excellence from any part of the world and it's just a matter of opportunity especially for women to come forward and lead from the front. Thank you so much. Where where do you see yourself in the future? See your company in the future. Where are you uh, see uh